five, six, seven, eight. I don't know. <laughs> Since I don't edit, I just redo, redo, redo. Okay. Yes, here is my paint. And I've got my canvases back here. That, and here's for my shipping. And uh, what else have I got? Oh, these are, these are canvases that I'm going to redo. I didn't like them, <laughs> so I'm redoing them. These are some that I'm still going to be selling. Um, and uh, let me think. Okay. Um, yeah, well, like I say, I'm hoping that this part that Noah bought is the part that he needs for the van and that we can get out of here because I'm ready to go. I can't stay in one spot very long. <laughs> I mean, two months on the beach? Wow, that was two months too long. Uh, actually, almost three months. You know, but uh, anyway, I want to be able to get out of here and move on. Uh, probably by March 1st, I will be getting all my things out of storage. Um, get rid of what I got to get rid of. My dehydrators are going to a friend of mine, and uh, uh, my Sela meal will also be going to her. Um, the only thing really that I really want to keep is my sewing machine. And let me tell you, I've had this sewing machine about 15 years. I've used it once. One time. <laughs> but with the COVID and all this stuff going around, I figured I could make me some masks and I don't have to go out and buy anymore. And what are you doing, little stinker? My baby. Oh, I love her so much. Yes, I love her so much. She loves me too. But anyway, uh, <laughs> yeah, she does. Okay, okay. <laughs> uh, anyway, I plan to do that. Um, just keep what I need to keep. And the rest of it, bye. I don't need it. I'm... Uh, it, it's been in storage totally about four or five years. I haven't needed it. I just move it from storage unit to storage unit. So, hey, come on. Minimize, minimize, minimize. I want to go to Habitat by Humanity. Habitat for Humanity, I'm sorry. And see if I could find me a regular countertop. Um, that way... I can have the sink I want in it. I can do what I want with it. I don't like the setup I've got right now, but it, it'll suffice until I can do better. Uh, if we get the stimulus check, I'm having a complete total tune-up on this. Now, Noah is going to change the oil for me when he's done with his van. Um, we've already got everything we need for it. And... Uh, I think spark plugs, I need some new spark plugs. He says, nah, but they have been in there for five years, so okay. Um, and uh, I still want them changed. Um, but I want to complete, I'm going to do have a lube job. I just want this in good working condition because I plan to head out west again. <laughs> again. Um, okay, baby, okay. Uh, but really there isn't that much going on right now. You know, it kind of like I feel like I'm stuck. But as soon as that van goes, I'm out. <laughs> I'll be unstuck. We're not going to go that far from here, maybe 50 miles. But it's a different view. It'll be out in the forest and... <laughs> It's where I found Jet. <laughs> it's where I got Jet at. Yay, I got Jet there. I just, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> you got to see this. Okay. No, baby, you love mommy? You love mommy? You love mommy? Yeah, you do love mama. <laughs> That's my girl. That's my beautiful girl. Anyway, I, I love her so much. It's just... It, it, I feel like she's my child, for real. You know, that's an odd feeling, but 
I do. <laughs> she loves me too. But anyway, I'm not going to talk long. Uh, I already have five minutes too long. But I just want to give you an update of some of the things I'm planning on doing again. And uh, until tomorrow, maybe. <laughs> Love you all. Peace. Bless you. Take care.